what's driving the latest Bitcoin price correction. CryptoQuant's head of research, Julio Moreno, has the answer, and it all comes down to falling demand. But what exactly is apparent with demand? And how is it calculated for cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin? Let's dive in. Apparent demand is a metric used in financial markets to evaluate demand by comparing production levels and inventory changes. In the case of Bitcoin, it's calculated using the concept of an active supply. This concept tracks the amount of Bitcoin that hasn't been moved or transferred over a certain period. According to Nareno, the chart below uses the one-year inactive supply as a proxy for inventory. This means it monitors the amount of BTC that hasn't been moved or any transacted for over a year. And based on data from CryptoQuant, approximately 23,000 BTC have flowed out of the one-year inactive supply in the last 30 days, suggesting decline in Bitcoin demand. Uh, but why does this matter? Well, this decrease in demand uh, can put downward pressure on prices, um, especially when the market's buying pressure is insufficient uh, to soak up the additional supply. And with the Bitcoin demand significantly declining compared to Q1, it's no wonder prices are currently down. Uh, uh, but with that said, thanks for watching, and until next time, remember, even Bitcoin has its ups and downs, just like a roller coaster. Or as they say in the middle of a crypto world, how'd you stop for doing that? All I had for us, I spoke it with these animals, and the science is the federal reliving. And as I saw...